Hi there, enjoying the content of the channel? Then leave a like and subscribe. Have you ever wondered how the ancient Egyptians communicated their thoughts, laws and stories for generations to see? Around 5,200 years ago, a script as monumental as the pyramids they are often found on was born. This script, known as hieroglyphics, was the ancient Egyptians' way of recording the world around them. Hieroglyphics emerged around 3200 BC, during Egypt's early dynastic period. They were used to inscribe everything from royal decrees and religious hymns, to everyday tales of life along the Nile. However, hieroglyphics were not simply a means of communication, they were a sacred tradition, an integral part of Egyptian culture. This ancient writing system comprised thousands of symbols, with each symbol representing a sound, an idea, or even an entire word. Think of it as an intricate puzzle, where every piece has a unique sound and meaning, and together they form a vivid picture of ancient Egyptian life. The term hieroglyph itself originates from ancient Greek, meaning, sacred writing. But for the ancient Egyptians their script was more than just sacred, they called it MDWTNTR, or words of the gods. This term reflects the deep religious significance of hieroglyphics in their society, hinting at the divine inspiration they believed was behind this complex system of writing. This divine script was not for everyone though. Writing hieroglyphics required a vast knowledge of symbols and grammatical rules. The scribes who were tasked with this job, were held in high regard, as they were the ones who immortalized the words of the gods. Interestingly, hieroglyphics could be written in three different directions. Horizontally from left to right, horizontally from right to left, and vertically from top to bottom. This versatility shows the complexity and sophistication of this ancient writing system. Hieroglyphics were not just a writing system, they were a sacred tradition, a way to immortalize the words of the gods. They were the ancient Egyptians' bridge to eternity, allowing their thoughts, beliefs and stories to survive the test of time. Hieroglyphics were not for the faint-hearted, they required a deep understanding of symbols and grammar. This ancient script was intricate and elaborate with over 7,000 distinct characters. Each hieroglyph could represent a sound, a word, or even an abstract concept, and the meaning could change depending on the context. This meant that mastering hieroglyphics was no small feat. It required not only a vast memory for symbols, but also a sharp mind for deciphering their many possible interpretations. In the heart of this complex system were the scribes. These were highly educated individuals who spent years honing their craft. They were the ones who inscribed the stories of gods and pharaohs on temple walls who recorded the laws and decrees that governed daily life, and who penned the hymns and prayers that connected the people of ancient Egypt with the divine. The scribes were not merely writers, but cultural custodians, wielding the power of the word and preserving the wisdom of their civilization. And what made the task of the scribes even more challenging was the fact that hieroglyphics could be written in multiple directions. They could be inscribed from left to right or right to left, following the direction that the symbols, often in the form of humans and animals, were facing. They could also be written from top to bottom, particularly in monumental inscriptions. This added another layer of complexity to the already intricate script. But despite, or perhaps because of, this complexity, hieroglyphics held a prestigious place in ancient Egyptian society. They were seen as the language of the gods, a sacred script that held the power to shape reality. And the scribes, with their deep knowledge and skill, were the mediators between the earthly and the divine, between the spoken word and the written symbol. The scribes were not just writers, they were the keepers of a complex and prestigious tradition. They were the guardians of a sophisticated system of communication that, despite its complexity, served as a vital link between the world of humans and the realm of the gods. As centuries passed hieroglyphics gradually fell into oblivion, only to be rediscovered and deciphered centuries later. With the rise of Christianity in the 4th century AD, and the Roman conquest of Egypt, the use of hieroglyphics began to wane. The new faith brought with it a new language, Coptic, which was primarily based on the Greek alphabet. As Coptic took hold, hieroglyphics, the words of the gods, were gradually phased out, their knowledge confined to a small group of priests. But the story doesn't end there. The script of the pharaohs would not be lost forever. It waited silently, etched in stone and inked on papyrus, for its secrets to be unearthed once more. This moment came in 1799 with the discovery of the Rosetta Stone. This slab of black basalt, found by French soldiers in Rosetta, Egypt, bore a royal decree written in three scripts, 
Greek, Demotic, and of course, hieroglyphics. The Greek text was readily understood but the hieroglyphics remained a mystery. Enter Jean-Francois Champollion, a French scholar with a passion for linguistics. Over a span of 14 painstaking years, Champollion compared the Greek and hieroglyphic texts on the Rosetta Stone, slowly but surely deciphering the ancient script. His breakthrough came in 1822, when he realized that hieroglyphics were not just ideograms, but also phonetic symbols, a discovery that forever changed our understanding of this enigmatic script. Champollion's work didn't just decode a language, it opened a door to the past, allowing us to read the words of the ancient Egyptians for the first time in over a millennium. His achievement was monumental, akin to hearing the echo of a voice long silenced, a voice that spoke of gods and pharaohs, of life and death, of a civilization that had shaped the course of human history. The Rosetta Stone was not just a stone it was a key that unlocked the secrets of a forgotten script. And in doing so it breathed life back into the majestic hieroglyphics, the sacred words of the ancient Egyptians, allowing them to speak to us once more. Even though hieroglyphics are no longer used, they continue to fascinate us. These ancient symbols are a testament to the innovation and sophistication of the ancient Egyptians, allowing us glimpses into a civilization long past. This intricate script has shaped our understanding of ancient Egypt, providing insights into their religious practices, political life, and societal structures. Moreover, hieroglyphics have sparked a sense of wonder and intrigue, driving countless explorers, archaeologists, and linguists to unravel their mysteries. This enduring appeal is a testament to their cultural impact, transcending time and geography. In essence, hieroglyphics have become a symbol of ancient Egypt, immortalizing its rich history and culture. They remind us of the power of writing, not just as a form of communication, but as a means to preserve and share a civilization's legacy. Hieroglyphics are more than just a relic of the past, they are a testament to the power of writing in immortalizing a civilization's beliefs, values, and way of life.